you don't always want people to see your pictures. So I'm going to go ahead and show you how Apple allows you to go ahead and hide pictures. And then I'm going to go ahead and show you another way that's even a little better and a little more secure. That way you can keep your pictures private and you don't have to worry about prying eyes. <laughs> Welcome everybody. I'm Kevin from HelpfulTutorials.net. If you like iPhone tutorials, tips, tricks, please make sure you do me a favor and smack that subscribe button. I really appreciate it. We are continuing to grow and getting close to that 2000 mark. Thank you all for that. Now let's go ahead and just dive right in. First thing we're going to do is show you how to do it Apple way. So first thing we're going to do is go ahead and click on the photos. And here are some photos of little man. So what we'll do is we'll just go ahead and hide one. So I'll just tap on it. Go ahead and hit the arrow on the bottom left there. And here we're going to scroll down to where it says hide. We we'll go ahead and choose hide. And I'll say the photo will be hidden from all places in your library, but can be found in the hidden album. So go ahead and choose hide photo. Now if we go back to albums and scroll all the way down, you're going to see hidden. If you choose that, you will see the picture. So that is how you go ahead and hide it that way. Not that hidden if people know how to look for it. So we're going to go ahead and show you another way to do it as well. So now we're back on the main screen here. This time we're going to go ahead and hide it with a password protection. So unfortunately you can't do it through the photo albums yet. I don't know why not. I mean, that's such an obvious thing, but it's not there. So let's go ahead and click on notes and we'll go ahead and create a new note. And we'll name it photos. So now what we want to do is go ahead and add photos. So you can go ahead and tap on the camera down there and it'll go through and say, take a photo if you want to take one now, or if you want to go to your photo library, go ahead and choose that. We'll go ahead and select the photo and then choose done. And now the photo is in your notes. Why do you want it in your notes? Cause now what you want to do is lock it. So if you tap in the top right corner, you can go ahead and scroll down and there'll be a lock note. You choose lock note. Now you can go ahead and set up a password for it. We're going to just go ahead and say test. Put up another one, test. And then under hint, we can say this is a test. You could also have use face ID on there as well. Go ahead and choose done. You want to allow notes to use face ID. We're going to say OK there. So now this is locked. So now this note is locked to go ahead and lock it. All you do is click the lock at the top next to it. And now it's locked. So now no one can view that photo when it's in your notes. So what you want to do is go back to your photos and just go ahead and delete that photo. It won't delete it from your notes though. So now you have it in your notes, but not your photos. So that's how you go ahead and hide photos the correct way. There are also applications out there where you can go ahead and download them and hide them that way. I don't recommend that, especially if you don't want people to see what photos you're taking, because a lot of that is cloud based and they could have it on their servers and they're able to see it. If you're trying to hide it, I'm assuming you want to hide it from everybody. So this would be the best way to do it. The only way to go through and get in on this right now is to have that password we just set up or the face of the person that uses this and this will be able to help you hide your photos a lot easier. I do recommend step two, unless you know, there's no one really that knows how to use iPhone around you. Then step one should be fine. Here are some more videos. I know you'll love. Thank you so much for the view.